friends, it's Kimchi! And Tofu! Yeah! yeah! Alright guys, we are going into Tower God episode number 10. The third episode till the end. No, third? this is... No, what I, what I meant was we have three more episodes till we're done. Till we're finished. Oh, ah, yeah. that didn't make sense at all. But yeah, we're going to be finishing it this week. Mm. Are you guys sad or excited? Of course they're excited. We're going we're gonna to be finishing it this week and we're going to be going into Shokugeki. Oh yeah, Shokugeki. Yeah, Food Wars. We're going to get back into cooking. Get some clothes taken off for you. Yeah, yeah. My clothes <laughs> taken off, not yeah. yours. Yeah, yeah, of, yeah course. of course. Of course, of course. I'm going to do the cooking. Yeah, and I'll do the eating. Yes. Yeah. But um, we are going to uh, Tarot God episode number 10. Uh, episode 9, a lot of things happened on episode 9, right? We right. have Ko Ho, um, who died? He's Ho, dead. Yeah, he's dead. Yeah, he's dead. And we have Rahel, who is uh, injured. Yeah, Rahel is injured. We have people missing. A person missing. Oh, yeah. The big guy that's... Yeah, the big guy's missing too. So, uh, somehow connected with Rahel. Yes. Yeah, so it's gonna get interesting. So, yeah. All right, guys. Thank you guys so much for joining us. We are going to episode number 10. Topo, are you ready? I'm ready. All right, let's go. go. Uh oh, yeah, his best friend. Yeah. Oh, he's picking this disappeared. Oh, they were with each other from the start. Yeah, well, obviously connected. Yeah. yeah, but she didn't know anything about him, too. Oh. Wait, why would... What the hell? She... What? How did... So well, she, she told... Yeah, she told um, Kun. Yeah. But remember, she always had a feeling about um, Cole. So, yeah. I always thought that Kun planned this the whole time, but then she helped him. Yeah. Damn. God, so Kun was super smart through this all. Yeah, he planned the whole thing correctly. Yeah. Whoa. <clears throat> oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Oi! What? Ha! <laughs> what the heck? Ha! Where's your daddy? <laughs> what the hell? What happened? What do you do with? <laughs> oh my oh. god, dude! The testimony just. The hell? What kind of ability is this? <laughs> <laughs> what the hell is so cute? That's so funny. The administrator said the same thing back to him. Wait, so he just looked at him and then he started shrinking? Yeah. Whoa, he must be strong. Or whatever the power is. <laughs> Rock is so cute. I like that he's became friends with Bam too. Yeah. Speaking of Bam. <gasps> oh. She, she's in a wheelchair now. She can't walk. She got stabbed in the stomach though. She probably got stabbed like in the stomach and it touched her spinal cord. Oh. And that's why she cannot walk. <laughs> what the hell? Yeah, you just noticed now? What the heck? Come on, Bam. So slow. I actually like rock like this better. I hope Me he too. doesn't get bigger. Yeah, yeah. I agree. Ah, damn, she's going broke now. I'm drunk. Yeah. Uh, she's depressed about hope. Oh. Yeah, everyone's here. Wow, well, that was kind of them to do this for Ho. Yeah, Yes, so Ho tried to kill her. What? Well, not really. Was just trying to scare her. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Wow. Damn. Yeah, he did this to her. What? What? Oh, shoot. That's how she really felt about Bam? She thought of him as annoying? Yeah. Oh. Nah, Bam won't do this. Oh, Bam. Oh, 
Bam is too good for her. But you know, at the same time, like, she did kind of confess. She a, did. In a way, right? Yeah. <laughs> Why is this guy so drunk? <laughs> all of them. They are, they are wasted. <laughs> Cute. Yeah. Oh, she's leaving. Yeah. Ah, oh, damn. She has no like reason to climb the tower. That's why. Like she found the answer. Yeah, she found her answer. Yeah. Or she wants to go search for her answer differently. She doesn't want to do something to risk her friends getting her injured like the first time. Oh, okay. I hope. Royal enforcement. Well, this only getting. Oh! So oh, this what? is a Yuga imposter. Oh, what the hell? Whoa! Oh. <laughs> what a cute pet. Not even face. Wow. Is he gonna eat that test administrator? No. Oh! Whoa. That's like sin from Final Fantasy X. Yeah! <laughs> oh, he's Jihad's ranker. Ranker. Oh! Whoa. Oh, man, I even like this Onigiri ball, too. Yeah. Oh, he prote protects Jihad? Him? No, oh, him. the administrator. The administrator. Well, both of them. Oh. Who is the Oh. So the administrator is the one that put that note? Yeah. So, I think that's what he's saying. <laughs> These guys passed. Ah, ghost fails. <laughs> She's so cute. <laughs> Oh, Mich oh, she passed. Oh, yeah, yeah, Michelle. Oh, yeah, that's right. She did pass. Wait, what? Hold on. Did she pass or fail? Oh. oh. I thought he was just gonna turn and fall. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but this guy's like getting tortured. What the hell? By Shinzu. This guy's not gonna do anything. Yeah, this guy's not gonna help you. Come on, this guy's like the worst character in this whole freaking series. Oh my gosh, just tortured him. He wants to get tortured by Shinzu too? <laughs> What's that administrator test? Oh. Oh, so only Bam can. So that means that Bam's gonna be the one taking the test then? Yeah. But I believe in Bam. He's pretty strong. Well, I mean, he's the only irregular here, and that's the only way who's a lahel. Now everybody knows. Oh, whoa. Oh, what the hell? I was expecting. I didn't expect that from him. Yeah. Wait, what? what? Oh. I have no idea what the hell just happened. Kun was just pretending he wasn't gonna help him so that he could get them to help. Wait, Kun was acting or Rock was yeah. acting? Kun was. Oh, Kun was acting? Oh, they both were. Oh. 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 Dang. <laughs> that, wait, hold on. Who was, what was the acting part again? Oh, Kun acted like he wasn't going to help Bam so that he could get the others to help Bam. So he could get everybody else to be on the side to help him instead of all not helping him because I think he needs as many people as possible to help Bam. Yeah, but what I don't get is how, how does acting make them side with Bam? Power of persuasion. Oh, uh, persuasion? Yeah. Oh, wait, is it because, because of Rock's speech? Yes. Ah, so Rock was acting? I don't think Rock was acting. I think uh, Kuhn was to get Rock to say those ah, things. Ah, so he was riling up Rock. Yes. 
Now I get it. Because you remember at the beginning of the episode, when Rock went to Kun's room, he was saying he'd help Bam no matter what, and he wanted to help Bam climb yeah. the tower. Yeah. Oh. Even though what he was thinking was that Bam might not want to climb the tower because of what happened to Rahel. Rahel. Oh, yeah. Well, I mean, there's no reason to yeah. anymore because Rahel, he's, he just wants to be with her, and he's with her. Right. Luckily, Bam still wants to climb the tower, but it's for her. So it's like it kind of shifted now. Yes. Yeah. Well, I mean, not really shifted. He did get his so-called wish or something yeah. because he wanted to be with Rahel. And mm -hmm. now he's with Rahel, now helping Rahel get to the tower, on yes. top of the tower, because she can't walk anymore. Right. Yeah. Also, there's a lot of things that happened on this episode, too, with the administrator, uh, the Onigiri boy. What's yeah. up with that? So the Onigiri is part of the royal? Yeah, he's part of the royal guards. He helps uh, the Jihad family. And what he's doing is he's trying to retake the swords back and then also take out Anak. He's the evil? Uh, he's protecting the royal family. Okay. All right. So he's not technically evil. He's just protecting the royal family. So basically, he's, he just has an extra agenda. Yes. He has a hidden agenda. Hidden agenda. Yeah. Yeah. And that's what the test administrator found out about it. Right. But... The test administrator is doing his own thing too, trying to help out the Jihad family. Well, I don't think he's trying to help out Jihad family. I think because the Onigiri is saying that he wants to kill Anak, but Anak is an imposter. Yes. All I know is that, is that the test administrator, his only job is to wipe out terrorists. Yeah, take out anything that threatens the tower. That threatens the tower, right. Yeah. Wouldn't Irregular be part of it? Yeah, irregular is what threatens the tower. That's so, what they say. That's so he, why irregulars are frowned upon. That's why he wants to just kill Bam. I think that's what's going on. And that's why the letter. Yeah, it was to Aegon Ho. So that Ho would be the one to take him out. So it would seem like it was very indiscreet. And it had nothing to do with the test administrators. Exactly. <laughs> and the Ho, and not only that, a Ho tried to kill Laher. Because yes. the thing is, Ho doesn't have to kill Bam. I don't think that Ho could kill Bam. I f That's why. I, yeah, because the power and the strength between those two is so different. So that's why he used Rahel, because he knew Rahel was Bam's weakness. Well, not only weakness, but if you take out Rahel, why does Bam have to be in the tower for? There's no reason to. Yes. So that's like the easier way to take Bam out of the... But then what I'm just curious is that as a test administrator, I thought he's allowed to kill the test administrator? Yeah. Oh, I'm not sure. I, I think it's just that they're supposed to do tests and then the tests are supposed to uh, choose. Yeah. I'm the test is what happened. I and mean, if you pass, you pass. If you don't, you don't. So the way that they administer these tests, I mean, they could have the opponents go against each other to kill off each other so that the threats can be taken out. Oh, so but they can't do anything personally to the threat. I don't think so. I don't think uh. they would. But then looking at this episode, we did see the administrator um, shrink rock yeah. and uh, inflict pain on one of the the test administrators. Um, yeah. Yeah. So that's what I'm wondering. Why Why don't you just do it to Bam or Lahe and just get it over with? I have no idea. Oh. I, I'm, I'm a little bit oh. confused. Yeah. But also I, what I was curious too about is that they said that irregulars are the only ones that can take the administrator test. Yeah, and Jihad took the test. Jihad took the test. So that means Jihad is an irregular. Oh, is yeah. he? Yeah, that would mean, yeah. That means he is an irregular then. Yeah, that means he is. So that would make sense why irregulars are a threat. Because... Well, I thought the irregulars are a threat because, well, what is irregular? They, they're the ones that bend the rules. Yeah, they bend and break the rules, and they're usually the strongest ones. They're the strongest ones. Yes. And then there was another irregular. Oh, oh did it say that there was a jihad was a irregular? Yeah. No, it didn't say jihad was a re irregular. There was somebody. But there was another guy that was uh, a threat to the tower that wasn't a regular. That wasn't a regular. And that's why they have a test administrator like this to weed out those kind of people. Yes. Okay. I am so confused. About what? Just like about irregulars. So are they allowed or are they not allowed? That's what I'm confused about. I feel like 
the tower chooses and then there's people that can still come in but the test administrators the test it looks like this test administrator tries to take out those irregulars so it's like yeah you can take the test you're taking the test it's not like we can tell you no you can't because you entered so you're automatically allowed in but we can try to do something sabotage oh. it so that you cannot pass the test oh i see okay when you put it that way that makes more sense okay so they can't do anything about it yeah they can't okay they can't once okay. you're in the tower you're in the tower ah i see but they can kind of like rig it in a sense yeah i think they can rig it yeah but um there's also those test rules saying that in order to take the test you can't come in with people and rahel and bam knew each other beforehand so i don't know how they're still able to unless they're keeping that hidden or that confuses me if you look at the test administrator he's let a lot of things pass right remember when kun entered with the bag yes. he let that one go yeah um bam and rahel uh, this is just my opinion about this is that maybe he doesn't care about Bam and Lahel being together because he can use Lahel in a sense. Oh. Don't you think so? That would be the only way it makes sense for them to stay together is because he can use Lahel. Either that. Because that's his weakness. That's that's his weakness up front. But then at the same time it's like does this administrator really want to help Jihad or um, weed them out or is he planning something on his own end? Because like you said, he's letting a lot of things slide. He is. And he keeps saying things are getting interesting. Yeah, things are getting interesting. It's exciting him. Yeah, he's so finding out new things. Like he just found out that there's another guard from Jihad that's coming in to try and take out Oh, there's another that, guard? No, the, the Onigiri. Oh, Onigiri, yeah. Yeah, that's coming in to take out a knock and the swords and he's like well hey i'm doing the same thing trying to protect what's going on come have coffee with oh me. yeah 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 that's right so he's trying to he's teaming up with the royal teaming up with the royal yeah teaming up with the royal teaming up or teaming oh you think he's gonna use him i think yeah i think what he's doing is trying to gain intel why why what would the what, what intel would he get from onigiri a royal intel uh possibly i feel like Honestly, I just feel like this administrator is up to more than what we're seeing. Because I thought he was going to use the onigiri to kill, say, Bam. Oh, I see. Oh. But I don't know about that part. But yeah, I just feel like this administrator is really fishy. And uh, Rock, he turned small. He's so cute. Yeah. I want him to be stay like that. He's way cute. Yeah, I want him to stay like that. I really like Leroro. Yeah, I like him too. But also, one more thing. Lerero didn't know about that. No. he Because he was surprised. He was like, Nani? He's not the administrator. Yeah, he's not the administrator, but you would think someone like Lerero will actually know about that. Right, because he's, about, yeah. he's the one that's supposed to be taking care of the test. So there's still stuff, some stuff that Lerero doesn't know. There's a lot of stuff. Right. Or probably a lot of stuff that he doesn't even know. And I think that's why he's starting to not like what's going on. And that's why he teamed up with Kuhn and let Kuhn know there's a way to um fix the test oh wait hold on so oh so you think he's teaming up with kun Lerero told kun about the administrator test to help out oh, rahel to help rahel oh and yeah Bam. during during the meeting yeah 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 so it's like Lerero is going against the administrator right now because he doesn't like what the administrator is doing with the game mm, i see i see oh that that makes sense okay because i feel like Lerero likes to play by the books and mm -hmm. likes to play fair and what he's seeing going on right now is not fair uh yeah so he's seeing that it's corrupted yeah basically right oh yeah and also that one character left yeah, yeah. she yeah. left she's gone she's gone yeah, yeah. it's because she values friendship and she doesn't want to be the one that gets her friends killed like what happened in the past with the ship no nah, i don't think so what do you think because what it showed with the character as she goes by and you know aren't you when you said like aren't you gonna come to tower didn't you want anything and she smiled mm -hmm. right it kind of looked like she doesn't need to anymore like she's remember remember what her character past life was yeah that's why i'm saying yeah that, so yeah her past life was the boat her friends got slaughtered but also at the same time she didn't know what meaning of life was uh... she didn't know the meaning of life because she always been shipped around Okay. And the heron came came and uh, and invited her right and then she was like okay she came in but then when she left she was like 
you know, I'm just gonna leave mm -hmm. because I think I I I, I want to go find what the real meaning of life is. Oh. So what I'm saying is that she wanted to climb the tower mm -hmm. to find that, oh, or the meaning of life or something, right? But then after Hope passed away, mm -hmm. then she wanted to she she I guess it kind of clicked in her head that after Hope passed away, she had that time with her friends after she had a good time she's like oh shoot you know what this is what life is about you know yeah like it's about having good times making good friends yeah um drinking alcohol and just <laughs> being happy right um uh, yeah i think drinking it's just alcohol. and she ran out of money so why is she, she i think she ran out of money on purpose because she was done because oh. of the whole thing with ho ho was her last that whole was her realization when he died and uh -huh. she saw the powerful people fighting and going against head to head right. and the friends and everything what everything was turning into she decided you know what this is not where i want to be this is uh -huh. not how i want to see things again i just thought like she got what she wanted just like what bam uh -huh. he got what he wanted he what found rachel mean? oh yeah but he, he didn't have to climb up the tower he right. found what he wanted right but except now he has a different mission where same as her yeah. is i got what i wanted Right. I don't have to climb the tower to get that. That's what I meant by like she got a wish. Oh, got it. it, it yeah. All right, guys, that was uh, Tower of God episode number ten. Thank you guys so much for joining us. Um, we will see you guys soon for episode number eleven. We will be finishing Tower of God this week. So yay! Woohoo! Woohoo! So yeah, that was the most unenergetic. Un <laughs> Woohoo! Woohoo! Ever. <laughs> we gotta give it energetic. Woohoo! All right, there you go. All right, guys, thank you guys so much. You guys, stay safe. We'll see you guys very soon. Yes. Until then, have a great day, and we'll see you next time. Yes, we'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.